Flesh Gordon, not Flash Gordon. Flesh Gordon. Flipped over? Flesh Gordon. <laughs> so that one might be worth more than we think, but I haven't looked it up, so. All right, we're back again for another Thrift Along. Frankie's back. I'm back. Frankie's back. Is that baby now? Yeah, I'm let out of the house, very lucky. Let out of the house, two babies now. Two babies, yes. Uh, this is, I was looking at it, this is thrift number 10 for us. Is it? Lucky number 10. Jesus, okay. Said we are going to go 50, didn't we? We did, yeah. uh, Before we added up the total. So we've got four drawers. The last one was a dog shitter drawer from the <laughs> fucking Bumbery. Um, that was horrible. And uh, I'm going to go this way. And um, I'm on three, you're on two. Is that right? I think that's, I think right. that's right. Yeah, yeah that uh, adds up to nine, doesn't it? Um, so I'm on three, you're on two. We got four draws. We're going to Armadale. And I was just here a couple of weeks ago and my two favorite stores were fucking closed. Um, my two favorite stores were closed, so I want to try and go to those ones first. Now we're on time limit. We like doing uh, power thrifts though, don't we? Yeah. We actually find more when we do power thrifts. Yeah. So definitely more selective, just look for things that you know. Yeah. Easy to pick up. I'm just fucking smash it. Just smash it. Um, I probably won't film too much in the stores today, um, and we'll focus on uh, trying to get as much as we can. But we'll definitely show everything that we get uh, after each store, and um, let us know at the end uh, who you think's won this one. Um, I've already probably, probably put this uh, in the bag for myself uh, for a fourth win. Two up on you. I'm pretty confident because you, you, you quickly go to the baby stuff, and you, you know. I've had a very good run the last few days, so I'm feeling. Be confident. And look, my last couple of uh, solo ones have been. Last week was good when I went for my uh, uh, audition, which I still haven't heard back for. So I've still got a week before I find out if I get this commercial yet. Um, but um, the week before, or the week before that, was fucking dog shit day where I found nothing. So, and I don't know if you've ever found fucking nothing before. It's very rare, but yeah, it does happen. It's very rare, but it happens, and I like to show everything on this channel that uh, happens. But let's go to the first door. Let's do this! So we uh, finished, uh, how many stores did we do? Five. five or six, I think it was five or six. Uh, I showed a video of how many stores we went into, but I didn't film inside the stores this time. Um, we've got all our stuff laid out. We're gonna show you everything that we got, and we're gonna let you guys decide who wins or loses uh, this round of thrifting. Bread and butter. So we got uh, these VHS tapes for 50 cents each. Um, these will go for $10 each, so there's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 bucks right there. Um, stoked with that John Farnham uh, whispering Jack live. Um, that's going to be a good one to watch, but um, Queen might go for a little bit more than uh, $10 live, but um, these videos definitely sell. Uh, not on Netflix, a lot of them, and uh, pretty damn good, I reckon. Yeah. So there's uh, already 70, 80 bucks in the kitty. Also some DVDs, these ones were a buck a piece. Um, these ones were 50 cents each, these Tour of Duties. Um, these Tour of Duties will both go for about 15 to 20 dollars each for the seasons. They weren't three bucks each, they were 50 cents. Don't worry about that. Um, <laughs> the bill, you got season one. Yep. Yep, what, 20 bucks there maybe. Uh, Wild Boys, that's new and sealed. So uh, with the Jackass movie, 15 bucks. Uh, Forever Evil, never heard of it. Might be worth more than 10 bucks, we don't know. Flesh Gordon, not Flash Gordon, Flesh Gordon. Flipped Fl over? Flesh Gordon. <laughs> so that one might be worth more than we think, but I haven't looked it up, so we'll find out. Uh, Police Academy, gotta love them. Another Jackass, because of the Jackass movie. 
And uh, Sesame Street, old school, volume two, mm. three discs in there. So nice. that was a buck. Oh no, is the disc missing? That's... Is it that one? Mm -hmm. No, is it meant to be three discs or four? Is it three or four? We'll find out. I might have fucking uh, got chipped there, but that's all right. Um, these were a buck each, but these were all, um, all sealed. Oh, Pingu. Pingu, whole head Pingu. These go for about, the Pingus go for about 15. I don't know this fucking wibbly pig who the fuck that is. Uh, and Wob Wats. What Wats? You yeah, know what that is. I know what a Wat Wat is. Yeah. I don't know what a Wat Wat is. Uh, so we'll just pretend $10 each for those ones, because uh, why not? Solid. Uh, we'll start off with this. The Wiggles. Toot toot, chugga chugga. Yeah, I actually picked up a um, $5 lamp from the Salvos last week, a vintage one, but the, the top is a bit dirty, let's say. So this will be quite good to stick on the top. Chuck in the little girl's room. Nice. Um, vintage puzzle, uh, mid 90s, just good subject matter. Bread and butter sort of stuff. Uh, a few vintage books, very selective today. Just ones I hadn't seen, just went with the author. Um, she's been involved in the early Dragonlance series as well, so didn't even bother checking that. This one here I needed to build on a set I've already started, so that was the find. And then just a couple of like, vintage sets that I haven't actually seen before. So, uh, solid, solid. Nice. Yeah. Carry on. Bits and pieces, yeah. Yeah. Western Force, just yeah. a stubby holder. You love that shit. <laughs> I've got these. So a Gallipoli book to Hell and Back VHS. Last uh, was 10 cents and this was a buck. I've also got a hat. It's uh, still in the car. I have to go and grab it out. And, and the hat on your head. And the hat on my head, yes. Yep. Got for the game next week. Uh, a couple of Eagles things. I had five and five but they actually only charged me for one so not too bad. Brand new sealed. They may make the, uh, the Christmas stocking this year for someone. <laughs> uh, a Demons pack of cards, which you actually found. Yep, we both got that. This, Wendy the Witch. I love finding these. So this is this is the sort of stuff that I used to read when I was really, really young. So finding this, that I can mm. repeat that with the little girl. It's going to be awesome. I got heaps of books today. Heaps of books today. Well, there's the Demons uh, cards I got as well, uh, same as you. Probably get about 20 bucks for those. Um, yeah, waffle. Sold. Yep, waffle. This, I've already sold before for $35. I paid four bucks for it, so. It says complete. It says complete as well, so. Already uh, sold this one before. Now this little fucking, K I haven't looked that up, this little KFC kernel. Like, I haven't seen that one before, mm. so. Hey, good on him. Hong Kong Fooey, that was three bucks. Hong Kong Fui, new with tags. Apparently you put your hot water bottle in there. Nice. So that might grab about 20, 30 bucks, but um, we'll see. Uh, the only clothes I picked up today was uh, this for five dollars or six dollars. Um, super dry. Super dry. Yeah. Super dry uh, jumper. And uh, what is it? Extra large. So might be might be staying in my wardrobe, but I'll get about 40, 50 bucks for that. Probably 50 bucks. I yeah. probably should have picked that up. <laughs> yeah, you probably should have picked that up. Yeah. You walk it. Yeah. Uh, books. Uh, just uh, some wishy-washy ones. These ones are all by the same kind of author. They might be $10 each, so you might lock them up for $25. Never seen that. Can't even say what it's going to be. These thrash axes or whatever they oh, are. That's cool. Uh, I don't know. I haven't looked them up, so... Yeah, you look at that. Let's see. Winner of the World Fantasy Award. There we go. It's got to be pretty solid. So, we'll look that up later on. Don't know what that's worth. R.L. Stein, Fear Street is now on uh, Netflix. They've made a Netflix season, so someone might want that. Nice. Uh, Terry Brooks, I found the Terry Brooks before you did. Mm -hmm. Four of them. I know you're pissed off, so I won't uh, get into that. <laughs> I've got all those ones. Uh, these ones, I think I ended up paying, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 of them. Oh, that's a good sign, because you see here you got one yeah. there, and then 18. And I, yeah, so you might have a whole set there. I might. I did pay, I think it worked out to about 30 bucks for all these, for the 18 of them. Yeah, you had to listen to a story. I had to listen to, to fuck this old lady tell me she used to be a prostitute. Uh, yeah. yeah, anyway, um, 
lotting up these uh, someone sold about 10 of them or seven of them or whatever for 50 bucks of this author so nice there could be over 100 bucks here definitely there's 18 18 yeah could should be about should 150 get 100. bucks worth there maybe more uh mm. maybe more but it looks like they were selling for about 10 to 15 dollars each this author what do you got on hiding in the back there and then it's just uh this fucking whoever this author is uh charlie harris i got these for ten dollars all these ones and um someone sold a whole set of these for 50 60 bucks so nice. laughing um yeah all right is that everything for you i think it is yeah kind of everything i'm gonna uh pull in a fucking wild card at the end because Ooh. um because <sighs> okay so we're at the uh we're at the store while i'm getting these books he runs over to the next store he should be uh deducted a point here well, I'm having to listen to this lady tell me she used to be a prostitute and um, he finds this great item. Uh, so I'm going to slip in uh, something else at the end. But uh, let's uh, have a look at your clothes. <laughs> in, in my defence, we are on a time limit today and I can't be standing around waiting for you to talk to old ladies. I didn't want to talk about her being a prostitute. She just tells me she was. All right, quickly. Uh, rugby, Canterbury, just body armour. Pay three bucks. Nice. Beastie Boys t-shirt has no tag on it. Um, relatively new stitching, but I just thought it looks cool. Feel good. A colorway on course golf. Yeah. Best. Golf stuff does sell. It does. I don't try not to pick it up too often. Uh, St Kilda on field. Babies one. Yeah. Kids one. Kids one. It's got it. Someone's wrote their name on it. Yes. Uh, Philip Island shirt. Nice. What is it? 2008. Eight. Kangaroos. Did pay up for that one a little bit. $15. 15. Dollars. I think it overpaid, but. It's embossed. It's pretty good. It's got number seven on the back. Uh, it's not player. Uh, it's not a player issue. I, I wouldn't have paid more than 10, but I'll, I'll give it to you. This was fairly good. Not bad. Game coming up. I might even be able to flip that pretty quickly, locally. Yep. Starter. Oh, I've sold a bit of starter stuff before actually, but I might actually keep this one. It's in nice condition. Nah. Someone's written their fucking initials on their bloody. A Volvo tag. jacket. Truck Someone drivers their... don't care about that. They, they, they will. This big bad boy here. Fucking, I'm deducting a point from you. <laughs> <laughs> and then the hat, which is still on the car. Go get the hat. Go get the hat. Yeah, the hat. Go get your prize possession. See, the thing is, let me know in the comments if you think that Frankie should be deducted uh, some points for not waiting with me and hearing this sob story from this lady about how her son just got out of jail and, and uh, her son's with a, a escort worker and she doesn't want to give up uh, her job and she used to be an escort worker when she was young to support the family. I had to sit, stand there and listen to it and Frankie ran off and he found this. So a nice 1970... 1973 slash hat. 1973 hat. Made in Melbourne. Yep. So you'll get about a hundred for that. I'm actually trying I'm trying to sell this before I even get home. Yeah. Right, so I'm going to put this together with the book and the VHS. Mm. And if, if, it, if I can sell it, I'll let you know you can chuck it in the video. <laughs> All right. So I reckon I can add these to the today's uh, thrift. Because <laughs> you did fine, though. No, you owed me. You owed me um, fifty dollars for a typewriter. So yeah. you found these. You found these uh, thrifting, and yes. they are uh, mine. Part of my thrift. So we've got a kiss, uh, kiss um, mag uh, comic book. Kiss comic book. I'm gonna keep this, of course. Kiss comic book there. Don't want that to fucking uh, be ruined. We've got a Kiss Live, Kiss Live 1996-1997 tour book. Mm. Tour book. I know I can't add these, but I've got to show the camera anyway, because these are fucking awesome. You frothing um, over those, aren't you? He didn't, Frankie didn't find these today. He found these a couple of months ago. He's only just giving them to me now, because we're finally doing them. But this is my golden possession. A Paul Stanley sealed Paul Stanley Creatures of the Night Creatures of the Night McFarlane Toys McFarlane Toys did Spawn Toys if you don't know but uh, this is the Creatures of the Night so it's a bit cracks and all that in there but it doesn't matter 
Um, it'd be great to have the whole set, but I've got the uh, Paul Stanley one. Mm. And I think uh, this would just win it for me just by having a Paul Stanley figure, I think, even though it wasn't in today's rip. You could say I could win just for finding it as well. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 they're mine, they're mine. Yeah. <laughs> all in all though, a pretty good day. Bloody good day. We spent just over four hours. I spent about 100 a day, 110 I think. How much do you spend? Yeah, probably pretty close to that, I would say. Maybe a little more, 120. Yeah. Alright guys, cheers for watching. Thumbs up uh, for... Thumbs down. No. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers guys for watching. Thumbs up and uh, put a vote in the comments. Who do you think is going to win? Nah, cheated. That hat shouldn't be included because I would have found that hat if I didn't have to get stuck with that lady because Frankie left me with her. It was a dirty, dirty tactic. Dirty tactics. Vote for your country. Yes, exactly. Sesame <laughs> Street is our country. All right, cheers for watching guys and uh, see you.